Ganun ka ramdam. Ito naman si Boss TL ngayon mismo nagtetest drive ng Grand Blink 300i. Good morning mga boss, this is Boss L again and welcome to my vlog Pimco Grand Ding 300i This is the first time we have heard of that name, that kind of scooter Pero nakikita na rin natin siya before And well, honestly speaking, I find that particular model a bit awkward So weird <laughs> Yung proportions niya, by the first look of it Mukha siyang spaceship because of the proportions of the nose uh, anyways, our agenda for today is to accompany a friend Pinasaludohan kita Hey! Na titingin ng or, or nagahanap ng Dink 200i and up to the Dink 300i And today we are going to Monumento specifically for that reason Titingin kami ng pre-love Kim Ko Dink So why do I need to be there? Ano, ano, ano? One of his primary requirements is uh, it would be maneuverable in traffic, in Manila traffic. Not just traffic, but in Manila traffic. Ulit-ulitin ko pa ba? Uh, lately, he has been joining um, scooter trips. First time for him to do so, especially going out of town. At uh, isa yung na-realize niya. No, ang bakal ng scooter niya. He can catch up, but then again, he is finding his scooter having a hard time catching up with the big boys. He was having to play a catch up every time na tipong umaarang kahit kami ni Vespa. So talaga sagad na sagad daw yung acceleration niya. And kami, papitik-pitik lang. It's like, you know, Parang katulad nga sa experience ko before, it's like the Duke 200 trying to catch up with the big bike boys. Parang ganun. Talaga makakahaboy ka naman kung pipilitin. But then again, pigang-piga ka na. Tapos yung mga kasama mong big bike, eh di pong paisi-isi lang. Wala na. Finish na. Due to that, he wanted to have an upgrade. Upgrade in the performance, upgrade in the engine CC. Before kasi pag natanong natin, hindi niya kailangan yun. Hindi niya kailangan yun. Tama kayo, tama kayo. Ako naman eh. Of course, hindi niya kailangan yun. If he is just to go about the Manila traffic, definitely. But then again, he has begun to experience uh, joining rides. And from there, yun, experience niya yung uh, shortcomings ng current scooter niya. Anyway, going back. So, he is looking at nowadays in the marketplace a 200 cc like para parehas pa rin nung ano nung like niya ngayon his other alternative on the other hand is the kimco dink initially i was actually trying to dissuade him from getting the dink kasi nga yung itsura ng dink no god no god please no uh anyway even with the upgrade in the engine displacement, it has to be still maneuverable in city traffic, especially in Manila. So it shouldn't be really that big. His baseline for a big scooter would be NMAX. Sa kanya kasi, pag NMAX, kaya pa. Anything bigger than NMAX would be, you know, a bit too big for him. But that is why we are accompanying him in the search for the Grand Dink 300i to have this visual comparison talaga kasi iba yung nasa paper, iba yung nasa specs as compared to what you see in real life, right? Bola lang yan! As well as tipo, no, uh, itetest drive natin yung NMAX and the Grand Dink to compare the power output of both scooters. Alright? 
So, medyo mahaba na yung nasabi ko. So, for now, we'll just turn off the cam and, you know, uh, on na lang ulit natin pag nandun na tayo. Alright? See you in a bit! Sakto! <laughs> Dito na ba? Dito na? Ah, okay. So, alright. Dito na kami. Hello, good morning mga boss. So, nandito na tayo. Nakalating na tayo sa Santo Oca near Monumento. So, yun yung mga kaibigan natin. Yung nakakulay blue, yun yung bibili ng thing. So, andito yung NMAX natin. Pinarasa natin by the roadside. Uh, sabi natin i-testing niya na before testing the thing para magkaroon siya ng comparison ano yung difference ng performance ng NMAX and yung dink so ayan si Charles preparing to ride the bike first time to drive NMAX Pasok tayo doon. Ito sa pinaka... Nasa ni Dink. So, habang wala si Charles, videohan na natin yung Dink. Maganda, ah! Okay, ito yung titignan na Dink. Maganda, makinis, ah. Legit yung kilometra, eh. Not bad! So, sakya natin. Ha? May luwag. Ayan, no? Ang laki ng... Limbo. Actually, boss, ano eh? Medyo bias ako sa Dink, ah. Kasi sabi ko, mukhang jet ski. <laughs> Pero iba pala pag in person eh, no? Patusok kasi yung uso eh. Nakakapanibago. Ah, oh, Charles, musta? Kamusta naman? Na Nanibago ka? Ah, uh, nanibago ko sa muso. Kaya yung haba, diba? Ah, yung haba. Kaya naman. Kung comfortable ka dyan sa cam yun, ang <laughs> sarap. Is it big? Too big? No, it's not too big. Comparable siya ng... Mas malaki lang ang TK NMAX. Mas maliwag siyang upuan. Sarap na itong bolster seat dito. Para kang may sandalan. Sabi ko nga Charles eh. Diba sabi ko medyo hesitant ako sa looks niya. Pero in person mukhang maayos naman pala. Luwag diba? Hindi pero ano sabi ko nga yan yung ano. Talagang definition ng maxi scoot. Maluwag. Mas relax yan. Magaan. Malaki, malaki. Mas malaki siya, oh. Kung dito nakikita ko, eh. Mas malaki siya. Kung madali naman kasing i-drive, wala problema, di ba? Oo. Oh, Oo. Oh. Same thing for you, sir. Hindi, pag nabili mo na, tsaka ako mag-test drive. <laughs> Gago! <laughs> Kamu na, kamas na i-arangkada. Malakas talaga. Maganda pick-up. Definitely improvement doon sa like mo. Oo, oh, mahal. <laughs> Ito, size comparison. So, ang itsura niya, sakto sa may box. So, mahaba siya by 10 na na, no? Mga 10 inches. Ang haba. Uh, so, um, ganun karamdam. Ito naman si Boss TL ngayon mismo nagtetest drive ng Grand Think 300. Ang nag-vlogger, pinag-video naman. <laughs> Video natin yung vlogger ngayon. Nung matikman niya sarili niyang gawa. <laughs> Very different yung ano. Very different karakteristik ng karakana na yun sa akin. Yun na yun? Wait lang. Gusto ko yung karakana na yun. 
Ano siya? So, mas mabigat siya. Pero since daw center of gravity, So yun mga boss, um, mukhang nagkasundo na. Go na si, ano? Go na si Charles. Uh, okay na sa kanya yung pink. Um, action tines type na natin, mukhang okay naman. And the looks of it, talaga mukhang fresh naman, hindi nagagamit. So ngayon, hinihintay na lang yung owner. Plus, kailangan din kasi yung ID nung talagang yung bayaw. Kasi sa bayaw nakapangalan eh. So... Uh, yung owner kasi nagsimba so we're just waiting for the owner to drop by here para magkapirmahan na then after that we'll be going home right see you then well pag binigyan ka ng sticker ha subscribe ka boss okay. TLPH you know <laughs> thank you boss uh, subscribe kayo ha yun shout out to the boss Jok <laughs> shout out boss Jok boss Jok Jong Piut Subscribe Jong Piut Wala akong papalito So mga sir So mga boss Nagkasundo na sila So nagkabayaran na Nagkapirmahan na Charles is now the new owner of A Grand Dick <laughs> Grande Google. <laughs> so Charles is now the owner of the Kimco Grand Dink 300i. Okay, so we're going. <laughs> Sir, salamat ah. Thank you. 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 Thank Yes, it's your heart to go. Nice bike. To be honest, um, initially we have reservations about the looks of the Grand Pink. Uh, sabi natin medyo parang naalangan ako sa itsura. But then again, seeing it personally, uh, it's not really bad. It's not really, it's not bad looking as I anticipated. So. Kamali tayo. Anyway, uh, it was a great day today seeing a friend buy uh, a new bike for himself. And with that, I guess we'll end the vlog here. So, thank you for watching. If you're new to my channel, please do subscribe to Boss TLPH and click that notification bell to be notified of our uploads. Alright? Thanks for watching. Like, share, and subscribe. Bye for now.